Hey guys, what's going on? Drax here, back again with another episode of Conan Exiles. We are back here today, and we are trying to make up a little bit for what we had yesterday our, uh, in our last video going on. Decided to try out some new armor. This is a pretty lightweight armor. It's the uh, Darfari skin armor. Looks kind of neat. We're also trying out the cutlass. Yeah, and I got a bow um, And the reason I'm doing this kind of outfit uh, Well, basically it's what I had around and I thought we'd try out something different uh, But besides that uh, we are actually taking the bow and we're gonna try our best I think I'm gonna head up this way uh, and I need to find some elephants or something big that I can get thick hide from because right now I don't have any thick hide and that's something that I really, really need. I also need a new water skin, uh, just twine and hide, which twine should be fairly easy here. Let me get some plant fibers. Excuse me, sir. Kill the alligator. Kill the alligator. Ouch. That didn't feel good. Okay. So they are dead. Give me some hide. Well, that's reptile hide. I didn't really want reptile hide. Oh, hey. There's a new building down here. I wonder who that is. Let's see. Plant fibers. Give me some more plant fibers. There we go. Okay, uh, new building. I wonder, I wonder, I wonder, I wonder who this might be. Uh, there's some antelope across the water there, so that'll be good to, uh, to get in with Krusty. I don't, I don't know who Krusty is. Krusty, I don't know you, but yeah, all right, so we got you. Okay. We're gonna just skin it really quick and run. All right, good. So, I uh, need to make that water skin really fast, really, really fast. Just come over here, try to avoid all the alligators. Okay, water, there we go. Oh, twine, I need twine first. Twine, uh, craft 11, water, there we go, we got one of those. That'll take a little bit longer and then we'll be good to head off. And like I said, I'm going, today I'm going after some elephants, uh, which I thought would be pretty cool to do. And I don't really know of many other ways uh, to, to get thick hide. Uh, maybe there are some other creatures, but we're gonna try our hand at getting some so I can step it up into some of the better armors and whatnot. So. Uh, I'm going to keep heading up this river, and then we're probably going to hang a left here pretty soon. Get him. I, I guess that bow just doesn't do that much damage. Hello. Fighter, come on. I like the way the cutlass moves. I really do. Uh, what do you got? You just got some arrows? I'm gonna loot all on you. Hello. Yeah, I guess I really wasn't hitting this guy that much. Either that or he's got some good armor. Something uh, along those lines. Coming up through here, I believe when I played before, this was where we came up through to uh, to go over to the elephants and whatnot to get our large or a thick hide and so that's exactly what i'm gonna do whoa what has this guy got he's got some of that i'm gonna take the meat that and that i'm actually really curious what is that mold brew hot and smelling of winter spices sounds good to me cut them up cut them up a fighter over there what do you got? Just some arrows. Take all of yet. Take, oh, oh, hi. Okay. You got something new too. 
a good amount of new stuff. I'm loving it. All right. Um, is there any cool treasure chest? There is a, a treasure chest. All right. It's not really treasure. Just kind of a chest full of stuff. Fat grub. I don't want any fat grubs. Fighter. Cut him. Yes. Yes. All right. Boom, boom. Okay. Ha ha ha. Yes. Okay, we can regenerate a little bit with that. Take all of what you got. And we'll take what you got. So because I'm wearing light armor, I could carry so much more. And I find that to be really awesome. Just really, really awesome. And I don't think I'm going to have a great opportunity to kill an elephant or something out here. But we're going to try... Weeping Ruin. We are currently... Where are we? We're up in this area. Sharp Tooth Pass. Yeah, there's an elephant. It's a big, big area over that way. So, can I zoom in with the bow? I really can't. I guess I could just sit here and shoot this thing. It doesn't seem like it's aggroing on me. Are those arrows even making it? I don't... I can't tell if they are or not. Oh, yeah. There we go. They're making it. Just doing a little bit of damage. All right, it finally started moving. It's not happy with me. But I can sit here and just keep putting arrows into it. I've put all the uh, iron arrows I had into it, and now I'm just shooting uh, regular arrows, which don't seem to be working that well either, but it's not too terribly bad. Got it down pretty far. Got it down pretty far indeed. Oh, jeez. Just kind of watch it here. I'm assuming that I can, like, almost psych him out a little bit. Watch it, watch it. Oh, he doesn't hit that hard. Whoa, 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 whoa. Was he gonna ram? Oh, the range on him is super big. Get up, get up, get up, get up dead oh whew. wow okay skinning knife let's get that elephant hide that thick hide man alive whoo that was super close all right we came what we wanted or we got what we came for and uh i'm heading back because that was super close Whew. all right collected as much as i could and i have actually decided to go for some heavy armor that's right heavy armor <laughs> Look at it. It's so cool. I'm loving all the different armors and stuff that we get into with uh, this game. That is one thing that I love. I'm absolutely gorged with the amount of armors and whatnot because there's, there's so much. There's literally so much that you can kind of get into and check out. And there's a lot of customization with it, which is a nice change from some of the other games that we play. Uh, but I should be able to go ahead and die this piece, which I assume this one will be green. So let's uh, save that. And then we can... Oh, my dog is barking because I think my wife is home. But we'll have that one. Let's uh, die my helmet. 
Should be green. Save. And then I'll do my gauntlets next. And then we'll we'll go ahead and save that one. And how are we looking? I think we're looking we're looking decent, you know, not bad. Got a steel maul. Decided to try this one out since I've been using the uh, two-handed sword so much. Got some new steel weapons since I lost mine in the boss fight. And uh, yeah, I, now I need to decide what to run and try and do next. Thinking maybe a cave visit. I'm not 100% yet, but I uh, think it could be a good one. Let's butcher you up. Come on. Yeah. Oh, exquisite meat. All right. Oh, we've gained a level. Cool. Um, I have decided to go ahead and come into the unnamed city and try and, you know, do some stuff over here. Uh, but I want to the size of my health pool. Yeah, I think this is what I want to put some points into. Let's do just a few points into that. Very good. That should help with our health pool quite a bit. Uh, we should, you know, be doing pretty good with that. But I figured we'd come over here. I've got all this new armor. I actually made up some dyes. Got this nice mall. And I figured we'd check it out, see what kind of trouble we could get into coming up into here. Now, I think we're going to end up getting some corruption, possibly. But I'm not too terribly worried about that. Figured we'd just come over, say hello to the to the locals, and, you know, kind of check things out. Here's a, a skeletal archer. Oh, wow. I am not doing much damage to him at all okay I feel like I'm missing him more than I'm hitting him and he's just not affected by my knockback at all come on okay he died oh he got me under the legs Okay, whew. All right, so there's another one up there. You didn't really drop much of anything. So let me... Ooh, putrid meat and feral flesh. Nothing, like, crazy. Okay. Oh, by the way, if you guys know how to find oil, I would really like to know how to find oil. That is something that I really don't have any experience in I've got one in all of my different storage and whatnot and I can't really figure out how to get more so if that's something you guys know how to do let me know and I would be most thankful but for now oh, we got a we got a guy right over here let's uh let's try and lure him up this way come on Oh, he's, he's, like, got that shield up. Look at him. He doesn't even care. You'd think with this hammer, he's just got a wooden shield. Oh, man. Okay, so let's unhook, kind of run away a little bit. We're crippled. As soon as, yeah, one more, one more. Oh, oh. okay, whoo, got him, all right. So yeah, just nothing, nothing really to him. Yeah, didn't didn't give me anything. All right, I I'm kind of thinking that this area is still a little higher than what I can handle. I feel like this. Ooh, there's two guys over there. I feel like this area just got a little bit tougher than uh, than what I remember. I remember actually walking in there and just kind of breezing through it pretty easily, and that would appear not to be the case anymore. All right, how about the Skittering Cavern? 
Something we haven't really been in that much, but should be a nice place for us to come in and check some things out. Oh, hey, you're not dead yet. Kill him. Uh, and I think I can actually harvest these guys. And we got Gossamer, so that's good. And Feral Flesh. We'll have to see what's best. Well, that's a ton of Gossamer. That's awesome. Okay. You're dead. So many more incoming. Ooh, yes. Okay, both dead. Good. Let's try the skinning knife. Ooh, tons of chitin off of that one. Which is awesome. Let's drop the the flesh. All of that. This chitin weighs 25 each. Alright, no more harvesting through here. But I do want to come in and kind of check some things out. Okay, you're dead. Okay. Just keep dying. Man, so good to, to kill these things in like two or three hits. Look at this. They don't hardly stand a chance against that big old mallet. Ooh. Oh, there's a few of them around. Dead. Okay. So I hear more. Yep, there's one. Spiders galore. And dead. All right. Now, there's got to be... Something in here, right? To to learn, I would think. I didn't bring a torch in with me, and I don't think I have the materials necessary to make one either. Yeah, coal and a branch, and a branch and that stuff. Man, I want to gather, I just don't have the weight for it. Just don't have any weight left. Maybe it's up here next to this light. Very well could be. Oh, hello. Oh, we ran out of stamina. We ran out of stamina. Gotta watch that with the big old hammer. All right. Nothing through there. Nothing up here. Yeah. Yeah, nothing if I press E on it. So I think... I don't think there's anything to learn in here. I'm sure you guys will let me know if there is, but not bad. I, I think I need to run this cave more often because they gave me a good chunk of experience. Uh, but I do think I want to try my hand here real quick. Let's grab some... Plant fibers. And then if I can get branch, give me, yeah, there we go. There's branch. Torch, torch. Okay, go ahead and drop the wood. And then we will run back through here. I just kind of take a quick, quick glance at whatever there is to see if, you know, there's something that we missed. Because I don't really think there would be. But you just never know. You never know with these caves. 
could have been really easily missed. Like some secret passageway. Or maybe it's just a cave for chitin. I don't even know what you can make with chitin. But it seems like a resource I haven't collected yet. And that we could stand to collect. So I think... Yeah, I think that's it. All right, let's uh, let's get out of here. All right, guys, I want to say thank you so much for watching today's video. If you liked it, please smack that like button, and I will see you guys for the next one. Have a good one.